Hey you guys, I tried something new. I tried two new things today. I cooked a frozen chicken in the crock pot and finished it off in the oven. And then I cooked some potatoes in an Instapot that I just got. I just got this thing, it's kinda neat. Um, found that at a garage sale for 10 bucks, can't beat it. So the potatoes, I cut up four potatoes, I peeled them, I put them in there with about a quarter cup of water, maybe half a cup of water and some adobo and some smoke seasoning, uh, the smoked paprika, and I put it in there for five minutes on steam. I opened it, um, then I added the cheese. I didn't put the cheese in before, I added the cheese after, and then I put it back in for about three minutes. I just forced it off halfway through. It came out pretty good. Um, and then the chicken, I put a frozen chicken in the crock pot. I put a stick of butter on top of it and I closed it, about a six pound chicken. It fit in the crock pot, right? On high for about five hours. Then I just turned it off and I let it rest uh, for a few hours until, you know, the hub husband got home from work. And I turned the oven on 375. That's as high as my oven will go. So I turned it on 375 and I put it in for about 30 minutes. I wanted to get it where I could get the skin crispy, you know, but like it didn't really work out. But the chicken was still very tender. Uh, I had him come in and cut it because he cuts birds way better than I do. Look at all that juice, you know. I'm going to reserve that and probably make soup or something. I don't know. But we had this for dinner. Uh, oh, uh, so um, when, before I put it in the oven, I added a bunch of adobo to this as well. A bunch of smoked powder, which is paprika, smoked paprika. A little bit of salt. And uh, probably at least three tablespoons of each. And I basted it with that juice on there, you know. Um... But I was just, I didn't, I wish I had recorded the whole process because it came out really good, but I just was messing around. Uh, he dipped his in some Korean uh, barbecue soy sauce and I used my angry duck sauce. Uh, these people out of New York make this duck sauce. Oh my goodness, it's so good. It tastes like the duck sauce you get at a Chinese restaurant. Anyways, if you try this, let me know. Y'all have a good day. Bye. He liked it.